So yes, uh, I'm Kent Saylor, I'm a leader calling coach. Basically, I help people feeling as though their lives have gone off course, transform their setbacks, self-doubt, and unfulfilled dreams into confidence, purpose, and a renewed sense of success. And one of the tools I use is something called the Passion Test, which basically, these are normally three hour workshops, but for the purposes of this meetup, we're gonna get this all done in an hour and a half. Why do you think passion is important? Anyone have any ideas on that? Thoughts? Because it gives you the drive, the motivation, and the sense of being alive, and embracing life, and joy, and love. Beautiful, great. What would your life be like if you were living your passions? Anyone? Awesome. Awesome. Totally <laughs> awesome. Exciting, maybe? Fulfilling? Yeah. yeah. So I ended up going to Calgary, Alberta, Canada to get my certification. And, and that was in October of 2010. And then in September and October of last year, I actually became certified to Passion Test for Business. And the really cool thing about that is we work with business leaders to help them determine what their business passions are. And then we work with their leadership team and their employees to actually work to align the employees' core passions to specific work functions within that company that tie to the business passion. So it's really kind of a cool thing. <laughs> I really learned one of life's important lessons, almost the most difficult way ever, and that is that making the wrong changes in your life out of desperation can really open you up to disaster. So flashback to the Master's Gathering, where I was introduced to Janet. What Janet was presenting that day was a whole new, completely refreshing way of looking at our life and the choices in it. She clearly explained how choices made from love and with our heart's desires are really aligned with God's will for us. And such choices then carry blessings for our own passions, for our own destinies moving forward. So it was really there where I finally came to realize that what I had been doing my whole life to make important decisions only with my logical brain was what actually messed up my life. When we deny our passions, when we deny those things that make our hearts sing, what we're really doing is denying what has always been God's will for us. There was a study that was done a few years ago that showed that only 20% only of working Americans are passionate about what they do. So what does that mean? That 80% of the people that you come across are unfulfilled, unsatisfied, not really doing work that they are interested in doing. And so the passion test really is a simple, powerful way to clarify what is most important for you in your life and then to align your life with that. She's got this quote that I love, which is when you are clear, what you want will show up in your life and only to the extent that you are clear. Here's the secret. Whenever you are faced with a decision, a choice, or an opportunity, consistently choose in favor of your passions. Now, maybe that seems like really simple, but guess what? <laughs> Most of us don't do it. So this is where this kind of abbreviated version of the workshop ends. Um, if anyone has any you know, questions, they want any help with anything, you know, I'll be here for a while, just stop by and, and we'll go through whatever you want to go through, okay? And webinar people, you're awesome. And video people, you're awesome. And you guys, super. So, thank you.